can you pinpoint anything that's that's led to this? Do you think? Uh, probably three T bikes. To be honest, I think they make good handlebars, but terrible bikes. We've been on one chainring all year, haven't we? So it's terrible. You can't race round. You'll know more. What a great advert for the bike. <laughs> <laughs> so what what's wrong with it then? Because you know, us mere mortals, they, they look just nice, like sitting they? on they a bike. Nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's just like yeah. a track bike though. It's just a track bike with gears on it. There's only one chainring, so you imagine if you're doing a climb, normally you'd have like a 38 ring to drop down to, but now you've just like a 10 cassette that goes up to a 42 with a 50 ring on the front. So you're knackered, you can't race around like in a one day race, never mind two week races or a week races on it. So, so did you climb on those bikes and think oh, straight away, you know that something's oh, yeah, not so right? Day one, I was like, this is not a good idea, but the team signed up to a contract with it and that was it. So we had to deal with it. With everything that's happened, how does it leave you feeling? You know, this is uh, your day, day in, day out, isn't it? Yeah, the main thing is just getting paid, you know, you've got a family to look after and all that now. So it's, um, the main thing is I just get paid and I'm happy to be off that bike, to be honest. It's, yeah, behind me. So what happens next? What do you do from now until the <coughs> next uh, big thing in your life? 